Welcome to 11th of May's Holy Blessing. Supreme Father says that may you become a soul with all rights and remain free from having to work hard by receiving blessings from the bestower of blessings at every step. Supreme Father says the children of the bestower of blessings, God is the bestower of blessings, automatically receive blessings at every step from the bestower of blessings. Blessings are their sustenance, that is they sustain us mentally, emotionally, they are sustained with the sustenance of blessings. Like these are also blessings and all the blessings which you listen on this beautiful platform with beautiful words of God are giving us sustenance on a daily basis. Someone who has such elevated attainments without having to make effort is said to be blessed. So you have claimed the right to have attainments for birth after birth. You now receive blessings from the best of blessings at every step and you will constantly continue to receive them. For a soul who has all rights, there is nothing but blessings. Blessings through drishti, words and relationships. So God says you now receive blessings from the best of blessings at every step. Now we receive at every step provided we are following his footsteps. That means all the guidance which he is giving us, thoughts, words and actions, the beautiful murli or the spiritual knowledge which we listen to, we are following that from early morning 4 o'clock, we are listening to him we are getting connected to him in meditation, then we are following every step and then we'll get his blessings at every step and you will constantly continue to receive them. For a soul who has all rights, how do we get the rights? We'll get all the rights provided we are following every step which God is get, telling us to follow. There is nothing but blessings. Blessings through drishti, word and relationship. God gives us drishti in the morning, early, early morning at 4 o'clock when we connect our drishti to his drishti. That means inner eye to his eye. Is non-physical life. Words, that means what we are listening and relationships. The way we follow relationships with him, him as a companion, as a father, as a sadhguru, as a guide, as a, as a relative, as a friend, whatsoever you want to. As a husband, anything. You can get his guidance as for that. Om Shanti.